Hola! I'm in Portugal right now and in this vlog episode I would like to take you with me from Sagres to Porto Riding along the west coast I think it might take me 10 days maybe 700 kilometers Oh, hello cyclist! <laughs> As always, I don't know what's gonna happen Yeah, happy backpacking! Let's go! Yesterday I met another backpacker, he's over there and his name is Patrick and as he also has to go up north, we cycle together um, to... Fuck! Um, ah, we cycle together to Lisbon. Today we have headwinds up to 50 kilometers an hour, pretty bad. It's 11 o'clock, we managed 25 kilometers. Yeah, it's just wind right in the face, right in the face, right in the face. We just had two coffees and now we we gotta go, gotta continue. Little bit of oil, little bit of oil. He just took care of my chain as well. Awesome! Having a break, it's lunchtime. Yay! Headwinds up to 50 kilometers an hour, and it's no fun. And we're gonna have a break for like one hour or maybe two. We managed 42 or 43 kilometers today, and due to headwinds, it's uh, freaking exhausting. I'm tired AF. Ugh. One more thing, we're not taking the Eurovelo 1, there's so much wind and usually that path is like uh, rocky and hilly and so with 40 or 50 kilometers of headwinds an hour we will just take the roads. Yep, I'm exhausted but yeah, we gotta go, 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 let's go! Headwinds all day long. This is where we're gonna sleep tonight. It's hidden in the woods. I'm very exhausted. I'm done. I'm just done. Cheerio, goodbye, salut, and adios. I just wanna sleep. Good night, good night, good night, good night, good night, good night. We had rain yesterday night, and our stuff is pretty wet. We're having a break behind Lidl. Oh, holy shit, how do I look like? Ah. One more thing, I need a shower. Seriously, I need a shower and a washing machine. It's getting disgusting. I, bleh. We managed to ride uh, 11 kilometers in one hour, which is almost nothing. But this massive wind is really going uh, on our nerves. And yeah, I don't know how to how to handle this. This wind is, it's, it's so annoying. This wind is, it's, it's so annoying. So much wind, massive wind. Headwinds of 
50 kilometers an hour. This wind, I really hate wind. Bitch wind. on point we just hopped on and we left Troya so we're going from Troya to Setubal we had to take the ferry because otherwise you had to go on the highway and yeah we're not allowed to and we don't want to we bought this ferry ticket and it was five euros per person so we'll just enjoy uh, I think 15 minutes of the ferry ride Okay, it's time to take a shower. It's windy, the water is freezing cold. <laughs> so yeah, it's time to, to get in the cold water. Ooh! And I took the coldest shower in my whole life. Down there. Here we go, goodbye, salut, and adios. Just one thing, I left Lisbon three hours ago. Reaching that city by ferry was a nice experience. I just uh, spent an hour in Lisbon, said bye bye to Patrick and then I continued riding. And yeah, to be honest, I'm not in the best mood right now. I'm on my way to Porto. I left Lisbon and I needed to pee. And <laughs> two and a half hours of riding and I didn't find a spot passed by a cafe and I, I really had to pee but that like there were only men outside staring at me honestly I'm annoyed by all these comments ah just shut the fuck up I'm a cyclist I'm just cycling if I was a man you wouldn't do that so sh I'm annoyed today I can't handle any comments like hola chica I have a bicycle as well oh blah 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 do you want to ride my bicycle freaking heck no I don't want to Whew. I didn't talk about that, but that's a very annoying thing while traveling alone as a woman. All these comments, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll, I'll talk about it another day, but it's just, sometimes it's just annoying. Because I don't want to, I don't want to smile and pass, I just open my mouth. Yeah, it costs a lot of energy to always be like oh, a little pit bull. It's just not my day. I, I will eat something. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Cheerio, goodbye, salut and adios. Oh, good morning six degrees it was okay 
yesterday i was so annoyed that i wanted to express that anger when i sat there in the grass i put my wallet next to my bike oh you shouldn't put your wallet next to your bike because you will forget it i will not forget it and then i packed my stuff and i rode my bike for an hour or one and a half i wanted to get myself some sweets in front of the shop i was like oh shit fuck i forgot my wallet do i have to ride back 20 freaking kilometers oh my god seriously no no i'm not gonna do this if you ever see this thanks jorgi and thanks stella for giving me a ride since one week i'm thinking of losing my wallet like this is no joke and i've been dreaming about losing my wallet and now i lost my wallet maybe i should just listen to my thoughts and listen to my gut feeling yep Ugh. I was cycling like a maniac today. I wanted to check what I'm capable of. Now I gotta stop. This is messing with my uh, time schedule. I know there are worse things in this world. Fuck! <sighs> what the fuck? I am so freaking stupid. I'm really annoyed because I don't want this. Freaking heck, I really don't want this. I'm so annoyed and I actually don't know why. Holy mother freaking shit. Fucking bitch. <sighs> Fuck you, bitch! Fucking bitch! Up, fuck! Fucking fick! Fuck! Ich hasse dich, du blödes verficktes Scheißteil! <coughs> bitch! Fuck you! Fucking up, fuck! Fuck, bitch! Ah. I don't want to deal with this now! <coughs> Hello, this is my uh, wind catcher, by the way. Two days ago, I had my anger attack. I had a flat tire and that flat tire just made me explode. This is not how I want to treat myself. Now it's two days later. Yeah, I just realized I'm in such a rush just too much oh i should film this and this and that i'm just rushing through portugal Vroom. i don't want to be in a rush <laughs> i'm really exhausted booked myself a room for one night went there i took a shower and then instead of just uh, relaxing i edited videos until very late at night and shit what are you doing why why do you do this what's your purpose what's your goal i wanted to leave home for four weeks now i'm on the road since eight months eight months is a long time i just realized that I can't keep it up like that. I ride my bicycle, edit my videos, and ride my bicycle and edit my videos. I will definitely continue, yes. I'm searching for a new structure because I want both. I've never done this before, like all this video editing and stuff. I finally found my passion in life I'm working on right now, like to find my balance. It's a process, so I just uh, wanted to let you know that I'm searching for new structures now. My goal is to continue living like that because this is what's actually making me joyful and happy. I don't want to stop. Many people were also asking me, how do you do this financially? And yes, for now, I'm living off my savings. It's no secret that uh, at some point I will run out of money. I want to make a living out of the things I do right now. 
I just created myself a new opportunity. I have many ideas and to give some transparency right now I'm reaching out to brands I love and brands I trust and I'm reaching out to supporters because this is what I want to do. This is my passion. This is how I want to live. I will see you in Porto. Ah and by the way thank you for all the support. It's good for the soul and I feel flattered. And another thing I just wanted to do is um, I would like to thank the people that support me financially. I will from now on uh, start mentioning all my supporters. I'm very thankful and uh, you help me out and yeah. Thanks Sudi. Danke Jonas. Gracias Dima. Merci Pina. Thanks Jana. Thanks Schillings in Karne. Danke Petra. Thanks Ali. Gracias Jerome. Merci nobody. Obrigada Selina, danke Alessandro, thanks favorite French guy, gracias Rich, obrigada Martin, danke Noah, thanks Marcus, danke Bea, gracias Yas, danke Eric, obrigada Oscar, thanks to a cyclist, thanks to Jeff, danke an Lars der Radladen, merci Oli, and thanks Larry. Thank you all for the support. Yep, happy bikepacking. I'll see you soon. Cheerio, goodbye, salut, and adios.